Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing another foreign food tasting video. This time, yay. <laughs> yay! This time it's Japanese food with my very good friend Ella Liddell who is a Lolita fashion model. Hi guys, I'm Ella. I'm a university student. I study Japanese language and culture and I also work freelance as a fashion model. Today I'm wearing a Japanese alternative fashion called Lolita. My dress is from Baby A Star Shine Bright, as well as my head bow. I decided to do twin tails today because I felt like being cute and pink. Yeah, I've known Ella for about 10 years, so she's one of my oldest friends. Yeah. Okay, let's start. We have lots and lots of stuff that we got from Hyper Japan when we went yesterday. Colourful chop. Snack. <laughs> Colourful chalk snack. Yeah, like a little ice cream shape things. Oh. Yeah. I'm trying to open it without everything exploding on the ground. Oh. It looks like they're all stuck together. It's like a tiny ice cream cone. Sticky mouse. I think the top of the cone is like a crispy ball and then the rest of it is chocolate. And it tastes pretty good. It's like eating a tiny, tiny chocolate wafer. Saku Saku Panda. <laughs> panda snacks. Panda biscuits. They're really cute. Mm. It's good. Yeah, very cool. melty, but very good. I'm really looking forward to these. They're um, honey koala march honey toast. And they have a koala on the box. They smell really yogurty and not in a good way. The koala is eating a banana. The... Ew. It's a not my favourite. Yeah. That's um. It just tastes like a tiny biscuit that's filled with sweet butter. Right. They've had like slightly bad yogurt mixed yeah. with honey. Gone off yogurt. Yeah. Ew. Honey, no, 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 no. Box again. This inside. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. That's quite nice. It's like a small chocolate biscuit. Mm. I have another one. Let's try this. <laughs> this looks super weird. It's like a make your own sushi <laughs> thing. But everything in it feels really weird and plasticky and like it's not food. <laughs> it That doesn't look like you're supposed to eat it. This is the weirdest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> okay. So I think you take one of the the white things. How? The rice. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So you take and the rice. Mm, yummy. And put it together to make a tiny sushi. <laughs> I feel like this is going to be more effort than it's worth. Okay. I got baby sushi. <laughs> <laughs> the texture is awful. That's bad, Harry though. If I had to rate it out of five, I would give it one just for the flavour. But the flavour's nicer than yogurt and honey. Yes. It's gone off yogurt and honey. <laughs> <gasps> oh. Neru, 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 neru. If you watch Japanese, if you're interested in Japanese culture and food, then most of you should know, no, 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 no. It's like this thing you have to make up. <laughs> I really wanted to try one of these, even though all the videos I've seen, it looks disgusting. Oh, it looks like some kind of science experiment. Mm -hmm. I always think you can tell a lot about a culture by looking at the food. Um, and lots of these things just seem to be half food, half toys. <laughs> Oh, it's going purple. <laughs> I don't know if I can show you. Uh. 
It's pasty. Oh, it's turning like the same pink as your <laughs> lights. Fabulous. It smells kind of good, but it doesn't really look like food. <laughs> and these are like sprinkles that you put oh. in here. Mmm. <laughs> I can't. There we go. That's yeah. the finished product. I assume you you kind of like take a bit on the spoon and then dip it. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want to go first? That's very disgusting. <laughs> it's strong. It's a very strong it's like grape. Grape. Tonight, I need to try that without the crunchy bits. Because the crunchy bits were like eating like broken lollipop bits. Yeah, it's a bit nicer if you don't put the crunchy bits on, but it's the weirdest texture ever. It's like. Yeah. Melted sweets. Yeah. <laughs> I think that says it all. That wins the prize for the absolute grossest <laughs> <laughs> confectionery I have ever eaten. This is matcha green tea flavoured yes. pocky. Yes. Which Ella cheated and ate yesterday. What? I don't cheat. <laughs> I've had Pocky before, but not this flavour. <laughs> Why, Japan? Why is all your food so hard to open? Oh, it smells good. I like it. Thanks. <laughs> I don't know how to describe it, but it's good. This is good. Mm. I'm gonna put them down before I eat the whole packet. It's like matcha latte mm -hmm. in Pocky. Poochie poo in choco, which is like small pudding chocolates. <laughs> is that what it means? Yeah. They look like tiny creme caramels. Yeah. I like that. Mm. That is nice caramel. Like rich caramel chocolate. That's probably one of my favourites. Mm -hmm. Soda. What is this called? Remini. It's a mango flavoured soda. Fizzy drink. Oh, you've got to open it as well. <laughs> That's the fun part. Nailed it! Uh, you haven't opened it yet though. Oh! What? There's this thing. It has a marble. And in this it. thing that was attached. So you have the lid. So you pop, what? pop up this, the lid, and you like whack it in. What is the marble gonna like shoot yep. into the drink? Yep. Uh. Why is it so difficult? <laughs> this is so hard! <laughs> no, I'm never no. gonna open them anyway. Try. You meant to press down firmly with your palm, apparently. How? The struggle. Who invented the this? Struggle. <laughs> I put it in the sink so I had a really hard surface to lean on and then put all of my weight on it and it made a massive banging noise <laughs> and now the marble is in there. First of all, it's incredibly hard to drink because of the opening and also it doesn't taste of anything. Some more fizz, slight, slight hint of mango -ish yeah. stuff but more fizz than anything else. That was so disappointing. It's another make it yourself. It's like a banana <laughs> thing, like a banana ice cream thing. Oh, it smells really banana-y. Fake mm -hmm. banana, not real banana. Mm, it's like this pick and mix banana flavour. That is goop. The chocolate. Look. Yummy. Mm. 
Hmm. Yeah, I suppose you don't really need to stick you can just dip mm. it. It's very, very unusual, but it's good. I can't even do it right now. Juicy fruit flavoured things. I think I like Twix. They like Starburst, but the texture is a bit weird. No, I'm not. I don't think this would be worth going to Japan. No. I forget chewy sweets, which I like Starburst, but. Final thing. Yay. Um, they look a bit like wafers. Oh, it says biscuit roll. Strawberry flavoured. Okay. Oh. Nope. Oh my god, oh, yes. Do you like them? Mm. Mm. I don't like the texture. They're so good. It's really, um. It's like. creamy and weird and it just squidges in your mouth. Got like rolls. Um, no, I don't like it. Mmm. 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 Oh. Okay guys, thank you for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then please subscribe. And if you liked to see Ella, then I will leave all of her descriptions, her links in the description box so you can check out her modelling page and her Instagram and all that stuff. I will be back next week with another video. Thank you for watching. Bye. Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs>